This is KMTV 3 News Now. I'm Megan Hahn with 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening. An Iowa hero was laid to rest in Council Bluffs Saturday, decades after his death. Just this past August, Noffit Air Force Base Lab identified First Class Navy Fireman Burt McKeeman. The community honored him for his service at the Oil Kanoski Funeral Home Saturday. The U.S. Navy Honor Guard carried the casket containing his remains. McKeeman died along with hundreds of his shipmates when Japanese torpedoes caused the USSS Oklahoma to capsize during the attack on Pearl Harbor. History was also made in Iowa Saturday for the medical cannabis industry. A Council Bluffs dispensary on 9th Avenue just off I-29 was among five locations statewide that opened for the first time Saturday. Management says opening day saw a big turnout. Qualified customers can begin to purchase medical marijuana products if they have a valid medical ID card. And on 3 News Now, meteorologist Mark Stitz, a winter storm warning remains in effect for portions in northeast Nebraska, Omaha, and the rest of our area under a winter weather advisory. All that goes through 6 p.m. on Sunday due to the potential for some dangerous travel across the area with the snow and wind that continues to move through. Heading into Sunday morning, the snow will continue at times, and it could be heavy at times as well, really starting to pile up in some areas. But I think by late Sunday morning, a lot of that snow starts to lighten up and thin out across the area, and by lunchtime, just looking at a few spotty areas of snow. As we head into Sunday afternoon, a little bit more snow is possible. But again, the worst of it, I think, will be heading into Sunday morning. Now, parts of northeast Nebraska already over half a foot of snow, but another one to three inches will be possible in that area. For the Omaha metro, we're looking at one to four inches. And just to the southeast of Omaha, we could see some heavier snow bands, and that could exceed four inches of total accumulation. The winds will stay strong heading into Sunday morning and through the afternoon as temperatures fall into the upper 20s.